And we shift our focus to some breaking news coming in from the national capital where battle lines are sharpened over Delhi liquor scam after his minister, Atishi. Now, Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal has come out hitting hard at the centre over the case. He said, and I quote, the whole liquor scam is a false. We were saying it from the beginning. Now, even courts have started saying it. It's a desperate measure by the BJP to malign an honest party like Ahmadmi Party. Unquote. Remember, a Delhi court recently granted bail to two accused by the ED in the Delhi liquor scam. And that is the big breaking news that we're getting you at this point in time. To get us more details, I'm joined by my colleague Ishika. Ishika, good morning. Take us the details about what exactly is Arvind Kejriwal saying over here. Of course, we did see a similar press conference being held by Atishi Marlena yesterday. Well, yes, Samia, as you rightly mentioned, the war of words has, in fact, intensified between the Aam Aadmi Party and the BJP after, in fact, you know, the Rao Zavenu court, in fact, granted bail to Gautam Malhotra and Rajesh Joshi. Now, you know, there after that, we saw how, in fact, Atashi is also a minister in the Delhi government. She held a press conference where she said that, in fact, the court has now now accepted that this entire case is bogus, it's false, and it was all done by the BJP, you know, BJP controlling the agencies like CBI and ED, trying to, in fact, you know, dismantle the image of the Aam Aadmi Party. Now, we, we saw that, in fact, the BJP also, in fact, responded to that, and, in fact, Menakshi Lekhi held a press conference where she cleared that, in fact, the court orders uh, says that it's only related to Gautam Malhotra's involvement in the entire case. This does not say anywhere that, in fact, you know, that entire case is false or bogus. Now, the other BJP leaders also, in fact, you know, tweeted in support of that, saying that, in fact, you know, the court has earlier also accepted that uh, Mani Sisoda is, in fact, the architect behind this whole scam. Now, after that, today as well, we are seeing that, you know, war of words has again intensified. After now, Chief Minister himself has tweeted about this, saying that all these allegations were false all the while, and it was just another tactic of the BJP to harass an honest party like the Aam Aadmi Party. Now, we are also expecting that there will be press conference that will be done by, in fact, you know, BJP as well. So what we are seeing here, that the war of words continue to intensify over the entire matter. Well, let me also read out to you what the court order says. The court order says says that while giving, uh, you know, however, it is made clear that the observation made in this order are only for the purpose of deciding the bail applications of the applicants and nothing contained in the order shall uh, amount to the expression of any opinion of the case. So that is what the court order says here. And that is what, you know, several BJP leaders are, in fact, tweeting as well. So we are expecting that, you know, drama will be unfolding in the national capital as press conferences from both the side are expected today. Over to you. Absolutely, Ishika. Thank you for getting us all those details. We shall come back to you for more on the story.